Hey Frugal Friends, welcome back to another episode of Frugal in the City with your girl T. Washington. I am the content creator of Frugal in the City blog and YouTube channel. Today I'm sharing with you five of my favorite websites that I go to to get inspiration for my meals that I plan for the week. So if you're looking for some really cool websites um, to gain um, inspiration and trying new things in the kitchen, stay tuned. I got some good ones for you. Okay, bye. All right, so thank you so much for staying with me. I'm so excited um, to share with you um, the websites that I go to to um, create my meal plan for the week. Um, last week I did really good. This week, I think I need to have more lunch options, but I'm critiquing as I go. So I have more, um, like dinners than I have for lunch. And so, um, I went over these five websites just to get some more inspiration for this week when I go to grocery shop. So the very first one is budgetbites.com. I love this brand. You have to um, uh, follow Budget Bites on Instagram. So Budget Bites, it's a uh, B U D G E T B Y T E S dot com budget bites and I love their Instagram it's just like you go on the Instagram you're like oh I have to try that meal and what I like about budget bites is it doesn't have like ingredients that you have to go and purchase and you know like you can go to the stores and you spend like twenty dollars on <laughs> on the ingredients to go into the meal. So that's something that I look um, for as well when I'm looking for websites um, to gain inspiration um, is to get uh, um, websites that have or recipes that don't doesn't have so many ingredients to create a meal. You know, like just the basic ingredients that you have. In your cupboard can create the bomb meal so that's what I like about um, budget bites and they have really good crock-pot meals um, she also have really good um, meal planning um, ideas you know so um, she's single so you might have to double some things <laughs> she doesn't have a family well this is what she she doesn't disclose that she does or not but um, the meals that I have created it does not stretch like other meals have from um, you know mom bloggers okay so that's number one um, budgetbites.com gotta get it and the second one is girl on the blur.com girl on the blur b l o o r Dot com. I love this site. <laughs> um, it's so good. She has really great crock pot um, ideas and um, a lot of meal prep. She does meal prep and she specializes on um, busy people. So her meals are very quick and easy. Like I can really create a meal within 30 minutes. Um, if I'm not on Instagram or anything like that or anything that's, <laughs> um, you know, having me distracted. Like, I can really create a meal in 30 minutes. Um, so, I really loved that website. is girlontheblore.com. She also has Instagram, so follow her on Instagram as well. And Gimme Delicious. Oh, my gosh. Like, Everything you go you go on to the website and you're like, oh my gosh, I need to try all of these meals. And all of the websites that I'm telling you to go to, there's not like out of the way, you know, ingredients that you don't have in your cupboard. 
So it's spelled G-I-M-M-E-D-E-L-I-C-I-O-U-S dot com. Give me delicious. So good, you guys. <laughs> um, I keep going back to these uh, five for a reason because they really have good meals. And it's really um, good, you know, like flavorful. Um, I have not had to like critique a lot of stuff. So um, these are my favorites. And iHeartRecipes.com. Now, I love her. You follow her. You have to follow her on Instagram because she has some funny, <laughs> funny, funny posts. But she does, you know, also upload her recipes um, on her blog and on um, her Instagram account. So she is super funny. Like she is really like another cousin, like one of your cousins. <laughs> Um, but like she actually taught me how to fry chicken. I never knew how to fry chicken and I give it all to her because I did not know how to fry chicken and I tried it her way because what she does is she soaks her chicken in like water and like water, I think salt and something and like a lot, I think lime or something, I forget. But for four hours before she fries it, that's why, oh my gosh, it's crunchy on the outside and juicy on the inside. And it's, oh my gosh, so good. Like, we we maxed those, um, <laughs> those chicken wings when I first made them. They were so good and, like, so flavorful. Like, they weren't salty at all. It was just the best fried chicken I've ever had, like, in-house without buying from somewhere else so I love her soul food cooking and like her tips and tricks of being in the um, in the in the kitchen for she said that she started like when she was a teenager like always in the kitchen so yeah like her tips and tricks believe that she she has them for a reason like so good she got a lot of soulful food so like if you wanted to get some ideas for Thanksgiving or Christmas, I would go over to iHeartRecipes.com. <laughs> and the last um, website is Delish.com. Like their videos are so capturing, you know, you go on and um, they have Instagram as well. You're like, oh my gosh, I need to make that. Like, <laughs> how can I make that? <laughs> so good like I've have not any of the meals that I've tried with delish I haven't had to alter anything it like the recipe was on point never had to change anything um, and a lot of the um, foods that I have tried to create at home like um, they're not as salty because they use a lot of like um, fresh things, you know, like they'll tell you to have basil or they'll have, you know, rosemary, you know, like those are like normal things, but like it brings so much flavor in the food that you don't really need that much salt. Like, so if you're trying to back down on like salt and when they do say salt, um, have salt in their recipes is not that much salt. Like it doesn't require a, a lot, um, of salt. So I love that. So yeah, those are my five um, websites that I go to to gain, you know, inspiration. Um, and also like when I find a good recipe, I keep it in rotation um, so that I can go back to it. Because like if it's good for my daughter and my husband, that's a winner, you know. <laughs> Because I've had had some flops, some things that I like, but my husband didn't like, or my daughter didn't like, but my husband liked, you know. So, um, trying out new stuff that all of, you know, we all like, those are like some gems that you want to keep. And I like that they're always, there's always new recipes. It's never like, 
something that they re had to repeat, but it's like a plethora <laughs> of recipes on each of the sites um, from dessert, from brunch, if you want to do a, you know, at home brunch and try to be pretty and everything. I'm trying to do this new thing called pretty plates so that I'm not enticed to go outside and eat. So I'm trying to, you know, I said I was going to go to the Dollar Tree and get some cute plates and utensils um, or like serving um, plates. So like if I was to host something and have somebody come, I can put it on these cute plates instead of having to go and pay 20 or something dollars to have brunch or I can have brunch for less at home for you know a couple of the girls so starting this thing of pretty plates making our food look good at home so I'm not like I really want to go somewhere else and eat you know that's what you pay for really right when you go to a restaurant um, you go for the atmosphere you go for you know how they plate your food you know the, the presentation um, does everything for you so like I'm trying to have this whole thing of pretty plates so you know when I'm eating at home I feel like I'm out to dine you know so or if I have someone else come to visit that it's like you know you're out to die but you're at my home so yeah I'm really excited about my um, meal planning I'm still critiquing things um, getting better but having these websites on my side <laughs> with people who really know how to cook and helping me to cook um, is a plus so let me just go over this the ones that I said um, I'll also have the links below so that you can go on um, and check them out yourself. So one is girlonthebloor.com, budgetbites.com, gimmedelicious.com, iheartrecipes.com, um, and delish.com, D-E-L-I-S-H.com. So I hope that this was an awesome inspirational video to help you get in the kitchen and have some fun make some pretty plates um, and help you keep your money at home <laughs> instead of going out as much but um, yeah to get in the kitchen and make it fun and make good food while doing it so I will talk to you guys on the flip side thanks so much for watching and I'll see you guys next Thursday Bye.